Lonnie Shaw's lawyers want his indictment thrown out. Now, he's the Peach County man who was shot by a deputy in 2016 who showed up on his doorstep at 3 a.m. Shaw's lawyer argues that state law protects his client from being prosecuted in this case. Chelsea Bimeford joins us live from outside the Peach County Courthouse where a six-hour-long motions hearing just wrapped up. Yeah, Frank and Lori, tomorrow Shaw's lawyer will argue that his client felt reasonably in danger when he heard someone knock on the door at 3 in the morning and he had a right to answer that door with a gun if he felt like he needed to be protected. But today's arguments focused on what evidence will be allowed during the trial. Shaw's lawyer argues that there was no probable cause for the officers to enter Shaw's property or home without a warrant. He says that's a violation of Shaw's Fourth Amendment right. Deputy Brandon Williams, who shot Shaw, took the stand today. He testified that dispatch and his supervisor told him to go to Shaw's address after his son showed up to the hospital with a gunshot wound. And that's what lawfully allowed him to be on Shaw's property. Now, Judge Mincy says arguments will continue here at the courthouse tomorrow at 2 o'clock. For now, live in Peach County, Chelsea Bime for 13 WMAZ News. Thank you, Chelsea. During today's hearing, Judge Mincy denied the defense's request to obtain Deputy Williams' psychiatric records. Unless he succeeds in getting the indictment thrown out, Shaw's trial is scheduled to start Monday.